Well, boy, that's dark, bad exposure. Um, anyhow, Gracie's doing great. We we walked her for I don't know how long. Oh, at least a half hour around the yard, down the driveway, back and forth. Seeker was extremely anxious about Gracie possibly not coming back um, while well, she was in the fence. But we've had we've had Seeker out now for I don't know 20 minutes, walking her around. Got her out of sight a couple times. Everybody's calm, cool, and collected. So our first exercise around the house not having anybody disappear from each other for more than one minute or less at a time. It's going well. They're getting kind of quiet and lazy and accepting. And so we're going to do the same exercise tomorrow and every day, expanding the time. Because in wintertime, what else do you have to do? And the only way to keep warm in the winter is to keep moving. So I'm on my feet, moving, walking, warm. My face is not that warm, but it's not cold. My feet, I just have my my hiking boots on with two thin socks. I have about, I don't know, seven shirts. Seven shirts on, three pairs of pants. Uh, got a bunch of neck warmers and a hat. That way I can peel layers or add layers to keep warm. My gloves, actually, these silly little hunting gloves that I bought for photography, they're perfect. My hands stay warm in them. If I get start getting hot and sweaty, I take the, the cover off. If I get cold, I put that little cover on, and surprisingly, my hands stay comfortable. I can't believe it. And I have like three or four other pair of really warm ski gloves that I sweat in, and then they get freezing ice cold. And my fingers are usually freezing in them to begin with because the fingers are all separated. I have to pull my fingers up into the padded uh, palm part to keep them warm. Anywho, however long this has been, I don't know, at least an hour, I've been walking the whole time. I'm stopping for a break.